I'm Paul B from Paul B's Bass Box. Today I'm going to be showing you how to play Castle on the Hill by Ed Sheeran. For tablet jazz, go to jellynote.com, link in the description below. Let's get started. We're going to start with the intro slash verse, which is the same bass line, which is all in the key of D major. So we're going to start on the D, on the D string, F sharp, G, B, A. So that's D, F sharp, G, B, E. The pre chorus starts on G, B, E, C sharp, D. F sharp G and then go to the D back to the G again. The second time you play the pre chorus it's slightly different so you're going to be going to the G and then slide up to the B and slide down to the E. Then it goes to the C sharp, to the D, then onto the C. Then you're going to go to the F sharp, and then to the G again, then back to the D, and then on the G. For the last part of the pre-chorus, you want to be going to the G again, slide up to the B, slide back down and end on the E. So the whole section will sound like this. chorus it's the same bass line as the intro and the verse except you're playing it an octave lower so instead of playing it on the high D you're just going to be playing it on the low D on the A string so for the chorus you'll be starting on D F sharp G B A C sharp and D. The whole part will sound like this. For the bridge, you'll start on the B, G, D, then E. And then you're going to play this for the rest of the bridge. B, F sharp, G, D, D flat, B. The whole thing put together will sound like this. It 
It's a fairly simple bass line really, but it has got a distinct pattern in the verse which stands out. The chorus is quite hard to hear, but um, if you listen carefully, you'll pick it up and you'll be playing the whole song in no time. I hope this helped. Come back next week for more 5 minute bass tutorials. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. See you next week.